Della or Delia, Nelia, Graham. Harry and Baby. That was a marionette copy. So that's the new plaque for the three here. So this must be John, 1878 to 1963. Edith and Clanned Home. 1912. Arthur Walton, 1889, Once again, these tombs at this end happen to be backwards to the rest. This one's back to normal. Alright, now we're at the south west corner, fourth row. Alright, this one's on its own. Now we're going to make our way down a fifth row here. Broken. DV Vic Macintosh, missing you always, loving you forever. 1918, 2009. Trees growing here. McNabb Alexander. 1886. Wooden plaque. Wooden plaque. Another wooden plaque thrown over here. Two wooden plaques and a big empty spot where cars can drive again. Damaged wooden plaque. And a harm. 
care of it. Richard Allen Gordon, 1845 to 1931. So, we are going to make our way to the next row, starting here at the north end. Starting at the north end. Heading southwards. There's a hole here. February 17, 1910. Elizabeth Kathleen Simpson, born January 14, 1911. Died March 20, 1911. Janet Irene Simpson, born January 14, 911. Died April 17, 1912. So they all died within their first year of life. Agnes Annie Skelton. More wooden clocks. Uh, I can't remember, I think we did this one already, but I'll film it again just in case. And we're back here at the south end. There's another wooden clock. And another clock that uh, is backwards. Clara Isabel died three months old. Okay, so now at this point, kind of sporadic the way they're spread out. Starting here at the south end. We have a big hike. Alfred Skelton died May 25th, 1914, aged two years, five months. We've got W H J I those kids from the row before. And we have another wooden marker. Now just because this just is two lone graves here.
and between them is a wooden marker. Alright, and then there's no grave for all. cemetery so I'm not sure on their own. Oh, can't read anything on this. And then we have another small row. Peter Prokishin died 50 years old. Rocky A. Rogney died 17 years old. We've got a tree here with some wood. Some flowers. And then we have another one, just one. Finally, in the very corner here. May 11th, 1948. And we end with another wooden marker. So looking here from the north to the east corner. That's the entire cemetery. Just to the south, you can see the town of Aberdeen, Saskatchewan. <laughs>